Hello everyone, my name is James Ryan and I've done and I'm am and I am here to play for you some technical modded Minecraft with a few glitches here and there. Um now I've done quite a bit since I since you last saw me. Been experimenting with Thorncraft. Uh just to show you how I made this stuff, the crucible were the crucible was made like this. The Conduits were made like uh, conduits. The biz conduits were made like this, and the infuser, the infuser was made like this with any crystal. Uh, all of, all of these, most of these recipes are with any crystal, and the tank was made like this. The enchanted wood was made in Thormic Infuser like this. So yeah. Cool, eh? I did some experimenting, figured out uh, that glass give is actually only gl that glass, even that wood, that stone doesn't actually have a smelting value of one. It has like a really small smelting value. <laughs> it's actually glass that has a smelting value of one. So yeah. I uh, got to work with this uh, with this bunch of furnaces and stuff here. Uh, I put an MFE. I'm not sure if you saw that or not. I made myself some nano suit armor and fully charged it in the MFE. Um, still got a bronze helmet though. <coughs> I also made 16 deployers re most recently, and I've also been working hard upgrading the um equivalent exchange. Uh, this is a dark matter. This is actually a Mark II uh, and a Mark II energy collector and I've also got a Mark II relay in here. So if I take a look at Mark II, you can see that this is the collector Mark II, which is made with dark matter a b and glowstone around an, an energy collector and relay is pretty similar, dark matter and obsidian around the relay and the dark matter is pretty expensive it's a block of diamond surrounded by eternal at eternalist fuel or eternalis fuel i prefer eternalist eternalist fuel so yeah so it's pretty expensive um this a block of diamond is nine diamonds and eight each eternalist fuel is a diamond worth so it's around 17 it's it's well it's exactly it's um it's worth 17 diamonds, so yeah. <laughs> Some expensive stuff. Whew. And uh, yeah, I've just been upgrading that little by little. So I wanted to let you guys in on the system that I'm going to make with the deployers. And we're going to have to do that outside, which means I'm probably going to have to sleep. And I should be sleeping anyway. It should, uh, it would uh, help speed up the equivalent exchange. Anyway, um, still got quite a bit of time remaining, so I probably won't do that. Uh, so let me go back downstairs. <coughs> hmm. I've also did. I've also done some research with this, but uh, nothing too useful as of yet, apart from perhaps the stabilized singularity. But if I were to use that to increase the efficiency of a machine. As you can see I now have the recipe before it. I you can't actually look at the recipe. Um you can't actually look at the recipe in even in any eye until you've discovered it with the um by uh, taking a look at the research notes by by act unless you actually research it. Unless you actually you, c you can't look at it in any eye unless you've actually discovered it for yourself using the quotes and, and unlocked it by right clicking and reading the research notes. So yeah, that's good to know. So yeah. So while I'm waiting, I guess I'll macerate some more coal. I guess I don't need this sapphire sword any No. Oh, I messed up. I should have uh, restored its EMC with some of the covalence dust, but oh well. Oh well. <coughs> I also f 
figured out that you can um, charge the client star with this. Probably could always do that, but still, good to know, good to know. I just, I just, uh, I just never normally, I don't usually do it, so yeah. Yeah. <coughs> so in here, uh, storing up a lot of energy, so I'm going to stick that right in there. I reckon we should have enough energy to make another energy, another another Mark II energy collector now. So yeah, let's do that. <coughs> so I'm just gonna, because I just already taught it to my energy collector, I'll just do like this, and bam, I've made, I'll, I'll have made an en a Mark II energy collector. So yeah, and. Stick this right here on top of the relay, and bam, making lots and lots of EMC for me. Nice. <coughs> As for this, I think what I'm gonna want to do is make myself some uh, a bunch of cobble or something like that. Something like, I don't know, sticky resin, there we go, seeds, gravel, and l just get myself lots of cobble, uh, only three stacks is, three stacks is all I need, and I'm also going to make myself some, uh, what should we call it, uh, some paper. So let's go to chicken, and there we are, paper. Let's make ourselves a stack of paper. There we go. So now I'm gonna go research this cobblestone. I'd research books and stuff, but you know, don't want to waste DMC for the moment. So yeah. Almost done. Almost done. Hang on, let me stick that in there. Perfect. <coughs> Three percent chance of success, as you can see. Thing is, what I'm waiting for is some iron pickaxes, and, and is um, enough energy to make a bunch of iron pickaxes, uh, so that I can make a bunch of block breakers. So yeah, <coughs> because uh, so that I can yeah, so that I can get along with my go on with my plan to do s actually to um, make a lot of uh, clay blocks for the um people, what people, uh, for the, um, Hindu millionaire village people, so yeah. I'm, so, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do another part of this plan, that's and that's to get myself a lot of cobblestone which I can trade for iron, because, you know, that's pretty good conversion, if I do say so myself. I mean, after all, oh yeah, I also made myself a chainsaw and a diamond drill probably saw the diamond drill but you might not have seen the chainsaw so the diamond the diamond drill uh, actually acts both like a drill both like a shovel and a pickaxe at the same time whereas the chainsaw acts both like an axe and the sword at the same time so let me chop wood really quickly and same when it comes to dispatch